and uh, the TV3 studio was filled with the Holy Spirit as prayers were said for the nation Ghana. Gospel songstress Empress Gifty also added some scintillating worship sessions drawing God's attention to Ghana's affliction. Worship songs, appellations, and calls to God to save the country, Ghana. God's servants, broken-hearted and in need due to the coronavirus, shouted to him when it mattered most. In worship, they lifted his name. The worship reminding him of his covenant to save his people. Scriptures reminding citizens of the need to believe in God and also reminding God of his people's cry to him were hugely quoted. Off camera, other men and women of God poured their souls out to God in the studios. They asked God to save the country from the dreaded coronavirus. From prayer unto prayer, they provoked God to act and save Ghana. The coronavirus has already infected 53 people in Ghana, killing two. The National Day of Prayer and Fasting is to seek God's face in these trying times. And that's certainly a very solemn prayer for my, I mean, this, this is time for nationhood and patriotism. And if you can make all of these sacrifices, let's all commit to the call to pray for this nation.